All right, it's Casey Camera Boy. I'm back to the animal control in Wasco. Uh, I put a complaint on all three last time. Silva and the chick and the guy, the old man. Let's see if they have learned. Welcome to See the Doors will be locked during business hours. If animal controls are responding to an emergency, if you have any questions, please call. Okay, only if they're in an emergency. So they're open. There we go. There he already saw me. There we go. How's it going there? Good, good. I can help you. Uh, I want to take a look at the dogs. Okay. All right. Perfect. You looking for a dog? You yeah, looking? I'm looking for a husky dog. Okay. Well, I'm working on the project since the vaccinations are coming already. For I think is Shafter, Wasco, Tehachapi. So okay. I want to show people um, what they can adopt and what the process is. Gotcha. What's up, hey, Silva? What's going on? Chilling. Come on in. Have they talked to you already? Oh, uh, last time, yeah. They did, huh? Uh, yeah. See, I told you, man. Yeah. 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 I did. Hey, now I know. So. Right. Um. This is what we have right now. We're, this is what you guys uh, have. The weather is flipping with the light, so. Okay. They're gonna come and take a look at it instead of shut them off. So. Let's check the. If there's a, a hazard or something. At least it's not gonna be. Like, it's not gonna be a hazard like the. Silly's not gonna fall on top yeah, of them. Exactly. Here, so. oh, okay, perfect. So, um, when is the vaccination for Wasco? Because I know it's gonna, it's coming soon, no? That's what do you mean by vaccination? Uh, they have a thing where people go to the park and. Um, oh yeah. When is it for Wasco? Uh, right now they have a when they're coming out here. Okay. 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 Yeah, because I mean, um, the one from Shatter is I think on the 24th after the 18th. The, following week so yeah, I want to show people what the process is so for people who want to adopt a dog what the process is they just come out here we do meet and greets meet and if they greets. like a dog we can take them out okay they come out here they can bring their dog we can test them out if it all works out then we can okay do you actually um, kill the dogs that don't get adopted here or I mean uh, no it, it's really depending on space depends um, on if space we got the space then they can be here as long as they can once we get full that's okay. when we start letting people know, hey, we're cool when you Yeah, because I seen some posts a couple yeah. days, a couple weeks ago. That's it, like I said, you guys, they come in, as you can tell, we try to pair them up if we need to. If we know they get along, even better, go to their bio and everything like that. So people see, oh, I want a dog that's friendly with other dogs. And they see that they get along, and it's, it just helps them out. The dog's information okay. on their bio. But, man, we had about 10, 11 large dogs leave this week. Uh, they went to rescue. And oh, okay. those, that was hard because a lot of dogs didn't like each other and up until we have our last kennel and it's like an emergency kennel because in case of the after hours, okay. we need to have a place or dog. Those are not kennels. Uh, people donate a lot of money. They're meant to be... Oh, so people can actually donate like toys and stuff? Oh, yeah. yeah. Okay, where people have to go or come? They have to come here if they want to donate like... If they're bringing, so, yeah, if they're bringing like a, a dog food or toys or whatever, they can come and drop. It'll it be off acceptable. Here. Yeah, if they're doing a cash donation, they have to go to the city finance office. Okay. See, if he, if he has to be a cash donation, they have to go to the city. Yeah. We don't, okay. We don't have no cash. No cash at all. Here, no uh, checks, nothing. Only payment we do accept is debit or credit, and that's what we tell people when we call the finance office and take the payment over the phone. So a lot of people think they can come and. Oh, here's ten dollars for this service. Nah, you gotta go back. And uh, we do tell people when they want to come adopt. Hey, we understand that everyone has their finances issues a certain way. You pay with cash doesn't pertain that you can't get a service done or adopt a dog. Uh, you first, you want to come and adopt him or her. Okay. You don't even pay with cash. We direct you to the city. We hold the dog for you so you can go make the payment, and then you come back and we'll finish the paperwork so you don't lose your spot just because you're not paying with uh, credit or debit. So. That's pretty much it. Okay, so how many dogs you guys have for adoption now? Okay. All these are for adoption right now? Uh, some of them are still on the straight hold. So if, you, if you're interested in a dog, right here is the date that they're available. Let's see. So after that, that'd be the date. You can go ahead and take them. Okay, cool. I mean, people were interested last time, you know, they wanted to see the dogs, you know. Oh, I'm assuming, right. I don't know if you guys saw the video. Um, no, we, we got told it was a different. Um, it's a learning experience. One thing here in this department is okay. you learn as you go and hey, sometimes you're wrong and you just gotta, hey, cool, at least I know now when this situation comes again. Well, I appreciate that. I mean, no hard finish, you know what I mean, but you guys gotta get it, you know. It, it, it is what it is. Like I said, it's a learning experience. We're okay, always, perfect. I'm glad you guys learned a little bit about what the First Amendment is and the rights. Were you um, here last time? 
I was here. Uh, you were yeah. here? Mm -hmm. Okay, but I don't think I got a chance to talk I to you. Talk to you. No, I didn't. I didn't. <laughs> what happened to the chick and the old guy? That one that were here this time. Well, they're not employees. They're, they're not anything. They're volunteers, yeah. They're, well, they're not affiliated with anything. They're not. The but Biri, Biri is their supervisor, no? Is their direct supervisor? She's our director. She's our supervisor. You guys? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah we're we... both the same rank. It's, I'm not above him. He's not above me. She's the public okay. works director, but she oversees everything here. If something happens, we report to her. Yeah, because I was trying to get her footage and the guy's footage as well because they were taking pictures of my truck. Oh. Okay. But I couldn't get it because supposedly yeah, they were volunteers, so... Yeah, they, they're not volunteers out here. They, they were just out here. Just it was their lucky day to here. be famous, I guess. <laughs> I mean, mm -hmm. which they did. So, well, thank you so much. I think you guys have been very cordial today. Yeah, we got other dogs outside if you want to take Yeah, them. I'd like to oh, take them. These a look. are just our inside ones, the ones that are not as aggressive or scaring people when they come in. Oh, you guys got some aggressive ones? Uh, I don't want to say aggressive, but they're, they're intimidating, I guess. Oh, you that could one's say. cool. Intimidating. <laughs> I like that one. That one seems cool. Yeah. So you guys, whenever that, that thing happens, you guys are going to take some of these dogs to the park and then you're going to be ready for adoption, right? Again, it's a whole new system for us to do all that. Okay. We are working with it. Like I said, our adoption fees, everything we're trying to do so we can put that in now and have people come out and get involved. Um, the vaccines you mentioned, we're working with the vet. Okay. I think it's working with them. And I know one thing is we got to meet a pilot. Okay. It's a lot we do, but we still do what we can for the residents and a lot of stuff with the vaccines and the adoption fees. So for now and I we work a lot and we try to make it as easy as Those are the extra candles that you were saying, huh? Whenever you have an uh, extra dog? Yeah, so we're trying to get some more candles. I mean, Okay. It, it's in like there. I've seen you from somewhere but not here before. What's that? I, it's like I've seen you from somewhere but oh. not here before. I don't know where. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, were you were you on the cover or something before? Were you at the, the Sheriff Explorer program years ago, no? You just remind me of someone because I did the Sheriff like the Sheriff Explorer program for like two years. Oh. So yeah, that's why you remind me or kind of, you know. Like I said, sometimes we get out at 2 in the morning, 1 in the morning, and we have to come and put a dog rather than the person at the last minute, we're going to put you. Okay. And once we get out of here, we're going to list out where everybody's going to come in. Papa's out, we're going to get these dogs out of here. Oh, hopefully people from Wasco now see this video and they hopefully donate. Yeah. They're excited, I'm telling you. Yeah, poor little animals, they want to get adopted. <laughs> well, I'm hoping, you know, people from Wasco or... Kern County area because there's animal lovers, you yeah. know. I'm hoping they see this video and I will encourage my subscribers to come and donate, you know, like like little houses, you know, dog houses, you know what what else do you guys need? Anything they want to bring. Anything, dog toys, food, food, pet dog toys, food, dog toys, dog food, dog toys, dog bowls, anything. Bowls. Okay. Yeah. yeah, I mean I encourage my people, you know, now that my subscribers are listening, they see that you guys I've been respectful. Probably, as you said, you guys weren't trained about public photography, which, I mean, it's fine, because, um, I mean, even though you guys should, maybe not, not you guys, but your supervisors should have trained you on public photography. It's actually, it's a level of command, you know, like, it's your supervisor's fault, and probably your supervisor's supervisor's fault, you know, that you guys didn't get trained. Yeah. Yeah, we encourage a lot of people. I would like to, um, you know, we're trying to get more people to it's harder, especially in the weather. Now that yeah. it's really hot, we, we bring all the dogs in at noon because, again, it's hot. Okay. The surf out there is extremely it's as hot as that pavement, so it's something to where people come out uh, afternoon or, like, in the afternoon, and, hey, it's a meet and greet. It's not going to be the mm -hmm. best, but, you know, it's, you got to look out for the dogs. Yeah. How about for s for, for summer? I mean, you guys need fans and all that? Uh, we, we If people want to donate that stuff, cool. We'll make it work. A lot of this stuff is yeah. donated, and we... Love to show the donators, hey, whatever you guys donate, we put to you. So like that, you know, okay. that you're donating well, and it's uh, show and tell, and then we just throw it away. So okay. Well, I'm hoping some of my subscribers actually come and donate and come by. You know, I'm like Hopefully. donate. 
And I let it know that to tell you guys that it was me that sent them. So. Oh, okay. Thank you so much, yeah, man. No Very problem. professional. Yeah. yeah. No hard feelings. Oh, hey. Thank you, sir. Yeah, that's the one thing. Yeah. I, mean, I like I like seeing you guys being professional. I mean, last time you didn't yeah, know. <laughs> hey, but last time you told me not even press could have come in. Is that like? Well, it's not from again from my experiences. I've been here for almost gonna be four years now. Wow. When anybody comes in, like I said, even the press, I gotta get authorization from up top. Okay. That's just how I was trained. That's why I was like, oh, let me. If See? everything works out, cool. I didn't mind showing I'm telling you, anything, it's but their fault. No, it wasn't yeah, your like fault. Says, the news, even if they wanted to come and just, like I said, not that they come and say anything wrong, but they want to advertise just like how your good intentions yeah. were too, but it has to all come through the top. Again, we're we're right here and they're yeah. trying to come up from up there. If they say, hey, show them around, cool. Come on in. I'll show you whatever it is Perfect. we need to we can show you the well, I appreciate you guys' help, you guys' information, and as I said, I'm hoping people come by. You know, yeah, I adopt some dogs, because I mean, I'm an animal lover, so I wouldn't like those animals to get killed just because you guys run out of space. Oh, but I mean, if that happens, it happens, you know what I mean? Yeah, so. Well, for Dylan and I, we're here to help you guys out. So any questions you guys have, give us a call and we'll go from there. Thank that. you, Silva. Thank you, Lara. Mm -hmm. I appreciate that a lot. Stay safe, right? All right I'm out. All right, you too. Have a good one. You too. All right. So that's it. Wow, I'm really impressed. They, they actually did good this time. Uh, these are the kennels where they do the meet and greet with the dogs. So, wow, I'm actually impressed. I like I like how they behave today. Very professional. They got trained. As I said, sometimes it's the supervisor's fault, not their fault. So, I mean, like every other job, if your supervisor doesn't train you, then they just throw you to work and you don't know what you're supposed to do. I mean, you're not going to do things right so you're supposed to get trained so i'm glad city of wasco trained these officers on public photography and i encourage my subscribers to come and donate you know um, stuff for the animals toys blankets dog houses that you don't need dog food cat food i mean it will be cool and for the summer fans you know because i mean it's really hot so peace out people stay professional and stay safe